okay so we, now we are having another episode just making it up as I go along of things that I have to use things that I that are in my collection and that I am not sure if I should keep in my collection um hopefully I will have put the the video up that pertains to this before this video but it is about this eyeshadow now this eyeshadow is from Clarins and it is this color I haven't had it that long and it is stiff but it is also one of those that might not actually stay in my collection I don't even know if I can put it on anymore but you it it shines better when you rub it more but what I was going to do is add a topper anyway so that is what this is about should I keep it or should I not <laughs> and at this point it looks pretty dry it looks pretty dry it didn't a couple of weeks ago when I did my my reorganizing of my eyeshadows my singles so here we go I did prime my eyes and I am not putting a crease shadow I am just going to do this with a topper but if Clarins like I don't think I've had this six months and this is 12 months no 18 months after opening and I I haven't had it six months so that's um pretty bad actually pretty bad because I think this is the last time I'm going to put it on I think I've used it twice before this I mean it's it's getting sorry it's you've got it's let's try this again it's creamy on the brush <laughs> and it looks shiny in the pot but uh, you can tell it's already coming away from the sides but it's not going on creamy at all and we also don't hear a lot about Clarence on the YouTubes even though we see Clarence everywhere or at least I do so I don't understand it no nope, not even with the finger I'm trying to see if maybe the top layer is dry and underneath I'm I'm sh I'm breaking it apart <laughs> soon as I do my declutter video it's going to be gone D which is a shame because this was not economical this was this was not a uh, an elf price and it was not a boxycharm price either like really Clarence with the bleep the same thing with my Shiseido it's dry I do not understand is it my house well, it can't be because my my Charlotte Tilbury are great same with my Tom Ford and my Mac oops I went too high there Okay, not, not, not happy. Mm, uh, I gotta put some underneath. Let's see if this works. Ooh, today is the shakes day. <laughs> Big time. And I have to drive. Why is it on the day I have to drive, I get more shakes? It's not stressful driving, especially when it's only like three minutes away. Don't buy Clarence eyeshadow. Now, 
The other question I have is which one? Okay. I have the Glisten and Glow from Stila in I don't know what color, but it's Glisten and Glow. That I do know. Too lazy to. And I've got this one from Makeup by Mario, which the first time I tried it gave me a hard time. It's doing it again. Okay, now do I want something? And I'm getting flakes of it. And it's too late to bring it back. I think it works better with a brush, but okay. Do I want pink or do I want gold? This one pisses me off. I'm not happy with this from Makeup by Mario at all. At all. I'm very, very angry with it as a, actually. I don't even know which brush to use. Okay. Let's see. I hope you guys can see because I've <laughs> I've edited videos where I you know making it, it doing the makeup there. <laughs> that okay let's try the other eye I love the glisten and glow thanks Amanda <laughs> I am literally trying to get the same of everything that Amanda has, but I can't get my hands on everything. And uh, I went, I had made a comment on Shelby Wilson's latest video, and one of her subscribers commented that I can use a uh, package or mail forwarding system. And I've, when I say I've looked into it, I've looked at the first 10 words of, e of a sentence on each page <laughs> so not really and um, it scares me a little bit and a lot of them want uh, monthly memberships and I don't want to do a monthly membership because that's not it wouldn't be worth it for me because my budget is so little unless my my YouTube channel takes off my budget is so little that ordering something that I cannot get my hands on here at least once a month it would make it worth it for me it just wouldn't um, I would rather put that money into a beauty pie membership for the year and get one big order from beauty pie twice a year and a twice a year order from Ulta. That's pretty much it. So a monthly membership would not be worth it for me. But she was right. She, she was she was totally right. And I, I wish I remembered her name because with any luck she'll watch my videos. <laughs> Come on over to the dark side. <laughs> okay. Now one of the things that I read, one of the things that I read somewhere was a question that said, what was the one thing that you learned that made a huge difference to your makeup look? So I am using the brown. I was going to use the black, but let's go a little bit softer. And because I'm going out, any mistakes will be more easily hidden with the brown <laughs> just more easy and I need to find a better eye gel than this because this one is just not cutting it they are too dry granted these have been for I've had them for about a year maybe a smidge longer but still, they shouldn't be 
this dead this quickly. So being able to do even mini wings is what has made a difference for me. And I believe it's made a difference in my look. I hope you guys agree with that. I did not answer the question yet, <laughs> but I want to. But I also want to use a proper gel to see if that is even easier for me. So when I go to the drugstore to get my medicine, I will see if there is a proper gel available. And of course I will go to winners. <laughs> but I'm not spending a whole lot because Black Friday is going on. And uh, I've put in a couple of orders and unfortunately I put in my ColourPop order before Black Friday. So I don't even remember what I... That's pretty pathetic. I know I ordered the Riffa brushes. I thought there was something else I ordered. I may have done it when I was when my pills were kicking in at night. I tend to do that the most. It's not good. <laughs> Half the time I order something, it's after a couple of hours after I've taken my sleeping pills and and I'm just waiting for them to kick in. Because they take three, four hours to kick in. Believe it or not. I'm uh, I'm a weird entity. <laughs> and my husband will be the first one to say, <laughs> I do know I want to order the Merit package, but that's $100 between the ColourPop, which I had budgeted already, and the bonus riff for brushes. Um, I think I spent 70 Canadian on the riff for brushes, and I gotta go to my email and see what else I ordered, because I don't remember. Maybe it's my imagination and I didn't. <laughs> because I was looking at a lot of things yesterday, but this morning I closed like a dozen windows because I had been looking at Margin of Beauty to see what uh, she was saying with regards to um, the sales. And I also watched Kelly Gooch. I'm hoping to order, place an order with Good Molecules on Thursday. Not too much, because Good Molecules have decent prices. I don't know if this goes, but that's that's what I've put on. Um, this is what I use today on my face, my my weekender from Tarte. I have to use it, and it's in my to use. But it's not in my project pan, but it's in my to use drawer. Here's a few choices. Use them or not. So, with my Pixie and my Natasha Denona and my Cream Shop and there's another blush. Actually, that blush I should take out because it's so pale it's good for summer. This this blush, it's it's very, very light. It's a beautiful, beautiful pink with a lot of peach in it, but that's that's a summer color, so I gotta go put that away. So I've got Pixie, I've got the Weekender. I'll be back. I'm back. Okay, I used the pink, the dark pink. As, an eye line, uh, as a lip liner and created some problems. <sighs> but I need to use my Merit. I waited for a long time to be able to get it.
Why is it when influencers who know what they're doing make it look so much easier than what I just did? Yeah, I'll be cutting most of that out. <laughs> It feels really nice. It really does. Is this the 13th today? <laughs> Very creamy. And the darker the color, the harder it is. Especially when you shake. Um, which is why I didn't do it on camera. <laughs> uh, Clarence. Sorry. This is a dud. It's a dud. It's an absolute dud. I think Stila saved the day. I hope. I hope. I'll go check in the big mirror. But I think Stila saved the day. Mario is pissing me off as well. Big time. Big time. And these are also a dud. They're clay. Ottawa's built on clay. Except for the shield. But otherwise, if we're not on the shield, we're on clay. And trust me, it's hard. <laughs> and so are these. So I got to find, at the bare minimum, a, a brown. At bare minimum, I got to find myself a brown. So I am decluttering three duds in my collection. Which is why I like doing this. I like, okay, I'm going to use this, I'm going to use this, I'm going to use this. And I'm like, okay, it's easier to see what I have. It's easier to play with what I have. As opposed to going, I don't know what to use, which is what I need to do with my eyeshadow palettes. So tomorrow I have to use an eyeshadow palette. And my eyebrows were done with my highlighter, just in case I didn't mention it before. But I am so busy looking at my lashes because I have lashes and it's amazing it really is I used today I did use um, concealer I used my ZC concealer because I need to use it it's not a bad concealer it's actually better than the Dior backstage <laughs> for one <laughs> so I need to use it um, I mean the color, don't get me wrong, the color I love, but it's supposed to have a shine to it, and it doesn't. And I, I can't believe I actually put a very, very dark eyeshadow on, because I don't usually do that. Because they scare me. I scare easily. I really do. This one is, I hate it when they're different, and both my eyes are different, and I can never do the symmetry. So... As I keep babbling on and on and on, I have to do a Project Pan soon because there's going to be only one left after that for the year, but I'm here. I'm almost, I would say here is halfway, so it could be one or two weeks before I get halfway. I've got a lot of foundations I need to use, and I think I love them all. I think I love them all. Yeah, see, that's, that's, that's my goal. I can go, yay, <laughs> you know, <laughs> for anything. That's my goal, to just be able, I should do that one day. Hmm, that'd be weird. That would be weird. <laughs> but that's essentially what I want. I want to be able to just not even think about it, just grab something and I know I'm going to love it. That's my goal. Thank you, everybody, once again, for coming to visit with me. Please leave me a comment, like my video, and subscribe to my channel. A bientôt.